Okay, thank you very much. And I guess it's a, a very interesting moment to, uh, to relate to what was said before. Um, so if, you know, we live now in times where there is such an abundance of, of online tools and we all use so many of them at work that it's also very difficult to choose the ones that we prefer. And I think it's also one of the challenges for any online tool that, uh, that comes now because you have to spend time on learning something new and, and uh, that also requires effort and, and motivation. So uh, to, to make sure that it's useful, it needs to be efficient and it needs to be easy. This is the most important. And this is also something what, uh, what companies uh, usually, usually say, especially smaller companies, small, medium companies that uh, you know, have a limited allocation of time for administration, for mentoring as well, but also have limited uh, financial resources for that. So it's very important that any tool that, that tries to manage that takes into consideration the times we're in, but also this efficiency and, and provides that. So as long as this tool uh, will aim at making life easier, it will be useful for companies. And this is what um, I guess it aims at. And, uh, and, and for sure, you'll try to do it uh, very useful. And uh, one of the uh, points that I can pick up from the recommendations that your project also uh, pro uh, provided, which are also very interesting, is that, for example, it provides support for stakeholders like students and employers. And you know, it's it's very important that, well, especially when you want to expand the the pool of companies that offer apprenticeships uh, outside of what what you have now and outside of bigger companies, you need to speak a language and also provide tools that they need. And and the support is. Is, is crucial, yeah? Because if you have a mentor and a company, it's not like every person in the company knows how to like, guide a mentee. So um, this support in terms of like course that you're providing, it's very, it's very interesting because it, it gives skills for people who are going to oversee uh, the gradual enhancement of skills in the, in the apprentices. So it, it's very, very important. Um, but yeah, like it's, it needs to be amped in like, uh, you know, in a support tools, like what, uh, what Norbert was saying before this, uh, um, this, this, uh, alliance for, for European Alliance for apprenticeships, it provides, you know, uh, this, uh, very, uh, very big, uh, um, pool of, of, uh, of, of support tools. And this is something what I would also see to, to be done in the relation between institution and, and companies, especially new companies that you might, you know, we are now going out of the crisis, so we are all working on this resilience. So it's a good moment to, 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 to think how to encourage new companies to, uh, to join, yeah, to, 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 to provide apprentice, uh, apprentices. So for sure, tools like this one, which is easy, understandable, easy as communication, is something what has to be uh, has to be done, and if this tool uh, uh, you know answers this uh, this requirement, then then it's uh, then it's great. Then and I hope it's going to uh, enhance uh, the, the opportunities that uh, apprentices will receive around the continent.